Hello and uh, welcome back. Uh, today I am uh, kind of uh, relieved because I finally found my Pro Mod. It was uh, once in out of the 10 times I restarted my computer just the next day and my mouse wouldn't be stable. It was jumping all over the screen and it is really frustrating because then you then you click and then it's suddenly in the corner or it's suddenly there or suddenly there or it does a left click or a right click and just very uncontrollable and uh, up to the point that you think ah, I might have a virus but well I, I use a proper virus scanner and I was almost at the point of uh, reinstalling my computer and this morning I actually found uh, what it was and it seems to be with your serial port. Your serial port, if you have a device connected, like uh, your GPS, and then you also notice sometimes the GPS is not detected, uh, and MIA data somehow is not exported, or I get a message that the port is already locked, and uh, messages like that. Uh, that was okay, then I just rebooted, but that the mouse was jumping all around and pushing the buttons, that was. That was super frustrated. And uh, you can have the same if you have the, the USB to serial converters. And uh, they, can, they can have the same. And it has to do with this 30 year old mouse. This which connected to the serial. Microsoft is still now in 2021 trying to detect this thing. And, uh, and, and then if you look in the device manager, because my mouse was jumping again all around. So uh, I look in the device manager and I found it and it, and it looks like this. And if you see this, you can try to disable it by right clicking and disable this device. And, uh, but then it still will lock the port and then you still cannot use uh, your uh, GPS, you cannot see the, the NMEA data. So what you can do, that you switch off the serial mouse detection and uh, you can do that in the, in the registry, animate a little registry file. And uh, yeah, if you run that, then it will not uh, restart the detection of the mouse. And your port stays free, your mouse is not jumping, and you can just use your, your GPS or another serial device that you have. So if you are pretty sure I don't have a 30 year old serial mouse or some other pointer device that you have on your serial port or on another USB port, then you, um, then you can switch it off. And this, uh, and this will, wow, <laughs> I'm so happy I found this. And after you have run this patch, um, you will see that uh, you only have your uh, mouse as you should have. Maybe you have a special mouse it is here. But if it says here serial mouse, then you still have the problem. And as you see, I have here also the, I think this is my spectrum uh, analyzer, my USB spectrum analyzer. Uh, so that is okay, but sometimes it said here that it was a serial mouse and it was also on COM1 and then you have a problem. So I made this little patch here and every time I have a big Windows update I probably need to rerun or if the problem comes again. And it is very easy to detect if you have the problem again because or the port is locked. So when you start your GPS program it doesn't want to connect because now it now it wants to connect and uh, if it doesn't because it says the port is locked then or you really do have another uh, serial device connected or it is this mouse problem again but the most annoying was for me is that it was just suddenly going this this and then doing this and I was not touching the mouse and I saw all this so you think oh someone is remote controlling my computer or but uh, it is very simple. If you do it, I, I can make you see. Um, this value was set to 3, which means if you detect, install it. And I set that now to 4, which is uh, do not try to 
get this serial pointer device please and uh, after you run this you just uh, say merge and it will you be merged in your registry and then you need to reboot it and then the problem is solved and finally my mouse is moving as I want because that was so frustrating especially when I'm in the Arduino software and suddenly it starts to go everywhere so uh, I hope this helps for you as well so if you uh, have problems that your mouse is jumping or your serial port is sometimes locked and you have no idea why have a look at this setting and really if you if you don't have a serial mouse you can just run this patch and if you don't trust it you can set it back to three later if you have if it turns out that you did need it so there is uh, no harm done you can just try it so i hope this really helps because i was struggling for six months and i really i already took my computer apart trying to to uh, insert the cards again um, use another USB hub without USB hub one by one I took out my devices and it was not solved because I have one real serial port still in this computer and there I have my GPS connected and it happened but it was one in the ten times and sometimes it was the whole day I could restart it ten times and it didn't and then the next day there was no problem so you can imagine how frustrating that is and if you have that problem you know exactly what I mean so uh, I hope this helps thanks for watching and uh, I hope to see you next time